Look It's your girl, Queen Lene. And yeah, I know what I'm finna come on here and say by the looks of the title of the video. Hit that like button for your girl. Hit the subscription button if you're new to my channel. And leave a comment to let your girl know it's real. Hold on, son. And yeah, let's get into the video. Okay. So. Oh my God. This is my thing. It's one thing for you to talk about one person. Good morning, baby. You know we're going to get into this video. It's going to get juicy. It's one thing for y'all to go on here and talk about one person. But for y'all to sit back and talk about people and y'all, the way y'all living, oh my God. Mm -mm. Queen K, Quenisha, QK, whatever you call yourself, Quincy, you need to have several seats, baby girl. Good morning, boo. Oh my God. You got to know how many messages I just got in my time, uh, on my timeline telling me to come up and I'm going to make a reaction video about this nasty chick. Now, I tried to say to myself, but I see she's still on her making videos about people talking about women, dissing women, and all that kind of stuff. I see she come, keeps coming on her dissing women, talking about women and all this kind of stuff. So, with that being said, let's jump right on into this video. Hit that like button for you, girl. So... Quanisha, two things. Well, three things. Good morning. AKA Cloud Chaser. You sit on here and you talk about everybody. You call people nasty. You call people trifling. You tell people they don't watch their kids. You even told me I don't watch my kids. Say my kids run around like wild dogs. You say everybody's kids run around like wild dogs. They don't watch them. They not home trained. They did say that. Blah, 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 blah. I see why you come for everybody else because your kids are not home trained. Your kids run around like wild dogs. Your kids have no respect for you. Your kids are disrespectful. Your kids tear up everything. It's ridiculous. Your kids are not trained. You see, this is what you do. You sit back, you make videos all day trying to make money. You claim, as you claim, trying to make money. Bring some sanitizer, son. As you claim, you're trying to make money. How's you making money out here? When you're on child support, you got the man on child support still. And y'all so-called married, you got him on child support. You living off tenants, you getting food stamps. But you the same person that come on here and talk about everybody and a mama. <laughs> girl, baby, girl, the way that house look, Quanisha, you can never come on here and say nothing to me, nothing about me, or none of that, baby. The way your house look, it's sad. At least I cleans my house up. You can eat off my floor. Yes, she is. She's a big mess. She's a big whole entire mess. She's it's so bad to where you didn't delete your account. Like for real, you didn't delete your whole account. Hold on one second, guys. Okay, sorry about that, child. Quanisha, you are so nasty. You trifling. My front porch look better than your nasty ass house. Quanisha, you deleted your whole account. You and Jackie nasty asses. I don't care if I don't get paid for this video, baby. But I'm finna bring bring this video out. You are one trifling nasty ass bitch. You sit on her. You talk about everybody else, baby. Y'all been. I never come for me more ever. One thing about me. That's the vacant business. Baby. Well, not a vacant business lady I own the house right there. But one thing about me. My house stay clean. My kids stay clean. I got control of my kids. Your kids so bad. Has them kids that bad today? They broke three TVs, a PlayStation. He must have been really mad about that PlayStation, baby. Because that's probably what he all did was just set up and play that PlayStation. They broke three TVs. They broke a PlayStation. They broke your laptop. Everything. Y'all are so embarrassed to where the only thing y'all did was delete y'all personal channels. That is so fucked up. Y'all yeah, talk about everybody else's kids being wild. Y'all yeah, talk about everybody else's kids. But yet, y'all yeah, have no control of your own kids. And like I said, Jackie, you ain't left out. You still keep the kids locked up in the room. This is behind the scenes. Yo, baby daddy gave us a good look behind the scenes. And I'm glad he did. Hey, y'all try to go dig in people's past and try to bring people on her and try to so-called yourself exposing people. Y'all can't expose me because I've never been nasty in my life. Never. It sure is tickling me, Jackie. Now, thank you, Jackie. Hit that like button for your girl, Jackie, while you on her. 
Yes, it really is. You're nasty. Your daughter nasty. She's trifling. Hey. Yeah, it's tickling my soul on the inside, baby. My soul. That, that was Quenisha BD. That was Quenisha BD because she's not married. Look at Jackie and her thumbs up. Yeah, you get your own thumbs up. Let's block Jackie real quick. She's mad. But anyway, y'all. Yeah. Jackie Big Man, do y'all see Jackie on her? Y'all see Jacko? She's on her with them false teeth in her mouth. Them, them teeth stands out, baby. You can see them false teeth standing out. But anyway, yeah. Did y'all see how nasty Quenisha house is? That house so motherfucking nasty. That couch is black. It's supposed to be brown. That motherfucking couch is black. That tri couch is trifling. You can tell them kids don't do them walk around with food in their hands, touch everything. They ain't got no decent table to sit at. She don't even have a table to cut her food on. You know what she do? She put it on top. Yeah, Jackie came in. They pressed. They big mad, baby. She told my mom over here giggling on the inside. I sure am. Yeah, I went trying to dig for people past. Like, a lot of people make mistakes. But one thing about me, I've been a trifling person. Ever. I've never been a trifling person. My house never been trifling or nasty. So people can tell you what they want to tell you. But my house never been trifling. Both of them are nasty. She told my mom on her giggling. All that. Yes, ma'am. Sure is. Baby, I sure am. Y'all be trying to come for every motherfucking body. But guess what, baby? I woke up this morning. I, I hit the floor when I sink this shit at 5 o'clock in the morning. I hit the floor. But you know me, I ain't messy. I'm not getting up at 5 o'clock in my sleep. I went back to sleep, got my little sleep. Woke up like, yeah, let me make this video. But anywho, back to trifling and trifling. Jackie, you're nasty. You keep them disabled kids locked in the room. Hit that like button for your girl. Leave a comment. Jackie, you're nasty. You keep them disabled kids locked in the room. And it's sad, Quenisha, you can't ever, ever say sh nothing about nobody else. You hear me? Good morning, boo. Good morning, Miss Ainty. You can't never say nothing else about nobody being trifling, nasty, and nothing. You talk about my jazzy life, she keep her house clean. When she going live, you don't see nothing on the floor. Chrissy, you sit there and talk about Chrissy. You can't talk about Chrissy. You talk about Olivia and them, but guess what? All of their eyes are dialing and all their teeth are crossed. You sit here, you talk about everybody. I make videos about everybody. But guess what? Y'all are the most trifling, nasty-ass people in the world. How can y'all house be trifling? Y'all live in a trailer, first of all. How can y'all trailer be nasty? And you only got three rooms in it. When your husband, a.k.a. baby daddy, he must have been real mad at you. He went through that. Then you a whore. You sleep with anybody. You trifling. At least I don't sleep with everybody. Then you go around tomorrow. I have ten baby daddies. No boo-boo. No boo-boo. But anyway, like I said, yeah, so called. I mean, he 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 exposed you, baby, for what you are. That threw me off. Whatever, whoever just came on her. But he exposed you for who you are. Yeah, I said to her, yeah, I talk about everybody being trifling, being nasty, being lazy, not having no job, baby girl. Y'all yeah, can never. Y'all yeah, could never. And me, y'all, I, I want to come on here and tell y'all why in in the middle of the video, thirsty. I started school. I, I'm opening my own business up, yes. Queen Lene started her own business on Thursday. I have to take two classes, and my business is up. I'm still taking up law, going to law school. All it. I got my little life together. When I was sitting back watching everybody else from the back, I got my little life together. And, oh, by the way, I'm going to send y'all a card, Jackie and Quenisha. I'm starting a cleaning service. I'm going to send y'all a card so I can clean y'all houses up. Yes, I'm going to send y'all one of my business cards because I clean houses. Thank you, boo. If anybody, I travel too, baby. I travel to clean houses now, yeah. So if anybody wants their houses clean, I travel. So with that being said, let's get back into this video. Quinny, she and nasty. Bubba, he must have been pretty mad at you. He he must have been pretty. He said, you're nasty, you're a cheater, you're a liar. And he ain't, he lying, he exposed y'all, he is not lying. Because both of you bitches deleted child accounts. I showed one on there just to see some stuff. Yeah, that's right from the trailer they living in. Y'all can't even afford to stay in the regular house. Y'all can't afford And then, Quinnish, you got so many felonies. You can't afford Section 8. That's why you're so mad at everybody else, because they can get Section 8, and you can't because you got too many felonies. I didn't even know they get felonies food stamps. But like I was saying, y'all came on here, did all that talking shit about me. I can walk in my house right now, and my house clean to any one of them most houses. Do you hear me? You can eat off my floors. Clean off y'all floors. No, you can't. 
You got too much nasty shit on her. And for you to have them three little kids, somebody needs to hotline you. Y'all talk about my jazz. You're like, Quanisha, you don't do nothing but sit around and get drunk. What, what, what was you at when that baby got bit, bit up by that dog? That's how that baby got bit up by that dog. Oh, I'm watching my kids. I got 10 kids. I wish I, I got 10 kids that live here in my house, and I watched them. I wish I would let them kids run wild in my house, right all on my walls. I know what an ass whooping is. I know what that is. I know what taking the belt and taking it to the butt. I ain't going to beat them, but I'm going to take that belt and tap them on it if I have to. As a matter of fact, you don't even have to whoop kids. You send them in time out. That's one thing about me. I've never whooped my kids. I'm telling you, I know what a belt is, but I never whooped my kids. Because you stand them in time out in that little corner, they ain't going to want to do that no more. But anyway, they made a statement when I was at the dentist, because I took all 10 of the kids to the dentist with me and my grandchild. They made a statement like, look at them kids running wild in the clinic. Look at them kids. No. They weren't running wild. They were sitting there. They was, it was my birthday. So they was talking to me on the live with you guys. I have control of these kids over here. My daughter asked me the other day, she said, Mama, how come a person with you got a lot of kids, you can control us and you be on top of things and everything, you got everything in order. But a person with two or three kids can't control their kids. They don't be on top of nothing and their houses be nasty and all that kind of stuff. And they cause, she said, your cars be clean, both of them. Your house be clean. And you take care of 10 kids. How do you do that? I said, because at the end of the day, I'm a woman. I was raised in old school, not new school. And I had a mama that showed me and taught me. I had a mama that showed me and taught me. At the end of the day, I'm going to take care of me and my kids first. If I signed up for it, I'm going to do it. So with that being said, Quanisha, you're nasty. You're trifling. Somebody needs to hotline you. You talk about Jackie. I mean, you talk about uh, Jazzy and them and y'all keep hotlining them girls. No, somebody needs to hotline your ass. The way you got them lives, keeping the kids living like that and trifling and filth, and you get their food stamps in, you get their child support checks in, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. You're a bad parent. You're nasty. And your, that your baby daddy exposed you for the trifness you are. Like I said, y'all not married. You never did, but you never was married. That man used to sit back and look like, look at the fuck. What the fuck is going on with her? She sitting on her lap to people and everything. You are nasty. You are trifling. You ever come for me again, I'm going to let your ass have it. Do you hear me? I'm going to let you have it. I want you to come for me. I want you to ever come for me again. That's what I want you to do. I took uh Jackie Jackie teeth. I took you out of time out. I thought you was want Jackie on her trying to come on her uh clout. Yeah, I'm glad she got exposed too. They should have exposed her ass. He should have exposed her. He got tired of her going around lying, talking about people, trying to down people, and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, that was a fake wedding. Then there was a bootleg wedding, had a bowl and, and, and had salad lettuce and all that kind of stuff. Who does that had a bowl with sodas in it? Just sit back and watch. When I have my wedding, I'm going to let y'all join it. We're going to show y'all what a real wedding is. It's kind of cold where I'm at, too, guys. So I just got on this little thin shirt. But where I'm from, it's cold. So, <clears throat> but yeah. Yeah, I decorated the front of my house, too. I got little pumpkins and lights and trick-or-treat signs and stuff. You know, that's what a mother do. They decorate, they take care of the kids. But yeah, that bootleg little wedding they had, I would have never... Yeah, well, Little Caesars pieces, them $5 signing ready pieces. Then they had $2 wine and stuff, too. Come on, now. Make it make sense. She is nasty. She is trifling. She have no respect for herself. And you sit around, and you try to make videos about me. He so-called having a person come on her expose me. Talk, talk about I'm a hitter, talk about I can't read, can't write. Baby girl. A person can say what they want to say. A person can make up what they want to make up. But guess what? At the end of the day, I know what I do and don't do. That same person who came on here and told y'all that, they live in the same way y'all is. <laughs> they live in the same way y'all is. That's what's funny about the situation. So y'all can relate to him. Y'all get drunk. Y'all don't clean your houses up. When it's your kids run wild, how you think that dog, that baby got ate up at a dog? And need plastic plan surgery. Come on now. Y'all should put two and two together. Y'all should put two and two together. How hey, y'all think that baby got ate up by the dog? Because she won't watch her kids. He, she probably is a real mama. But what type of mama, example of a mama, are you? If you got a mama like that, I don't even want no mama. If my mama was like that, I don't even want it. Take her back to the store. Send her back to the delivery sender, whatever it is. Send her back. Hit that like button for you, girl. But yeah, if I had a mama like that, she'd be going back to the store. 
Return to Cinder. One star mommy Chrissy said, um, what are the um what she say on her thing? I forget. But she was like, what are the policies for, for returning baby daddies? What are the policies of returning mamas that's like that? Hmm. That's what I want to know. If my mama ever act immature like that, baby, I wouldn't even own her. I would disown her. But anyway, like I said, Jackie got the kids locked up in the room. Jackie house is nasty. Jackie's daughter don't even eat like that. She came on her, was eating that bowl of cereal cookies, whatever she was eating. She was turning them up. She was turning them up. Do you hear me? She was turning them up. Because it seemed like that was her first meal of the day. You hear me? And that's sad. Kids have to be greedy like that and starving like that. You hear me? Yeah, I get all the food stuff for them kids. Y'all try to make them eat bird food. It's sad. Quinesha was trying to make, she be having them kids eat nasty food like that. All type of trifling stuff. Them kids going to disrespect you when they get older. They're not going to respect you because they see how you on Bubba be on her clowning doing all that stuff. Yeah, Chrissy is happy and engaged. Chrissy doing her thing. She got 10 kids, but guess what? She's taking care of all them 10 kids just like I am. It be the ones with the 10 kids for me, taking care of their kids for me. The ones with the three kids don't even know what to do. Just playing family. That's it. Yeah, I'm going to go get my hair done later on too, guys. I got a whole lot of new girl. I'm getting it done before I go to class. But yeah, it be the ones with the three or four kids that don't know how to take care of me. I wonder why she said all that stuff about them young moms. Hold on. I was wondering why she was out here saying all that stuff about them young moms. Because guess what? They keep saying she's like them. She's nothing like them because they're they clean. They're clean. Anytime anybody exposed the moms, they never said not one time, or oh, they're nasty. They don't clean up. They're trifling. They never came on her and said nothing about them moms. They made to try to talk about them, tell them how they these many kids, they beg and they doing this. Okay, Ian, oh, yeah, I do that. Jackie gets stamps too, I know that. They're so jealous of me. They used to say I act too bougie. I act too this, I act too that. No, I just want to have something in life. I just want to have something in life one day. And I don't want to have to depend on it from the government. You hear me? I don't want to have to depend on it from the government. That's what I don't want to have to do. That's what I don't want. I want to take care of myself. That's what I don't want to have to do. Depend on nobody to do it. Y'all, I'm over here standing in front of my neighbor's thing. Standing in front of my neighbor's house making this little video because my kids are on that side and I don't want them to hear me. You know I heard cursing because you can't be messy in front of your kids. You can't do that. So, with that being said, Jackie, Quenisha, sit back, have a seat. And watch us and learn how to be a mama. Learn how to be a mama. That's what y'all need to do. And Jackie, if you a mama, you need to take care of them grandkids. You need to learn how to be a grandma instead of trying to be a hood rat. To my OnlyFans. Who gonna watch you two bitches? Nobody. How y'all gonna have an OnlyFans account? Ain't nobody gonna watch y'all. Who gonna watch y'all? Jackie, you bad built. You wear stockings to hold everything together, Jackie. You wear stockings. You're nasty built. You don't have a shape at all. You be on her thinking you look good, you don't. Quenisha was never married. They did that for the, for the fame or for the whatever you call it, for the entertainment. She never was married. Get it through your head, y'all see? It, it's all coming out now, piece by piece. It's all coming together. He is very upset. Whatever she did, then you're a cheater. How you gonna cheat on your baby daddy? And you was just to her talking about everybody else having sex with this person, having sex with that person. I've been with my boyfriend for eight years. My fiance, I've been with him for eight years. Do you think I'm going to cheat on him? Hell no, nah, because I know how that feel. You be with one person, you got to be with that person. Because you can have kids or anything. Yes, she was, they were so jealous of Chrissy engagement. I was so happy for Chrissy. Chrissy went through a lot. She was hurt. She went through a lot. And now she finally found that one person. I'm so happy for her. It take a hoe to be jealous of a woman. Chrissy is doing her thing right now. Chrissy is stacking money. They is jealous of her. Come on now. Y'all, y'all, y'all need to start telling facts, Jackie and Quenisha. You've been exposed. The cat is not the bag, Quenisha. You deleted your whole family account, you and Jackie. And this... <laughs> Yes. So we all make a video about me. Make sure y'all put a video on her with my face. Like this. 
make sure y'all do that. Because I know one coming. And every time y'all make a video about me, I get a whole lot of subscribers. See, what y'all did is y'all came on here trying to bring my channel down, bring my rating down. That's what y'all tried to do. When y'all so called yourself trying to get people on my channel to call itself exposing me. How you going to expose somebody when everything the boy was on the channel saying was a fucking lie? He's a fucking drunk just like y'all. I won't believe nothing the drunk say. Now, if he was on her not drunk and sober and one wiping his head every five minutes with the liquor coming out of his pores, then maybe I probably would have bleed it. But y'all sit on her, y'all believe anything anybody got to say. Try to call yourself doing this to Lena. Then they call me Lena. My name is Lene. Y'all say I'm the one over here illiterate. Y'all don't even know how to pronounce my motherfucking name. It's Lene, not Lena. Queen Lena. So with that being said, Quanisha and Jackie, y'all need to clean up your houses. Y'all need to get y'all shit together. Quanisha, you need to wash them babies more. You need to take the baths, put them on some clothes that ain't from the second down handy store. Ain't nothing wrong going to the handy store, the Goodwill and all that. Ain't nothing wrong going there. But you got to make sure you do stuff for them kids with their child support. You still had that man on child support. That man was playing his role. How much did you pay that man to play his role on camera? You have to have been paying him because that man looked like he was fed up. Told you, once them stimulus checks run out, he was running out the door. I told you he wasn't going to be there for long. Didn't I tell y'all that? So soon as that stimulus check stopped, that stimulus money stopped, he was stopping. He, was, he stopped pretending. He stopped doing everything. He stopped doing everything. Ain't nothing wrong. I told you, ain't nothing wrong with the good will. I go thrifting. I go thrifting there. But I'm not going to always get my kids no clothes from there. If I see some one or two things that's looking nice, I grab it. But no, that's not my preference. I go to Walmart before I go shopping there. Did y'all see that video when she went to Sam's for the first time and went to Walmart? She was like candy in a baby store. She was like a baby in a candy store. She was like a baby in a candy store, baby. She was happy she went to uh, Sam's and Walmart that day. She was happy when he went shopping there. Like, she ain't never been there before, baby. I go to Sam's every month. When you dealing with 10 kids, you got to go to Sam's, Walmart, or something. You can't just go to them little petty stores. But like I was saying... Quanisha house was so nasty. Did y'all see that couch? Yes, yeah, she been busted. Did y'all see that couch? Did y'all see every room he walked in the kids? She talked to, let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. She talked about how my jazzy life kids was writing on the walls. At least jazzy showed us and she clinked it off. Your kids got writing on every wall in the house. How do kids have crayon writing on every wall in the house? Please somebody tell me that. You're not watching them. You're not tending to these kids. Every wall he walked to had a corner of trash and it had writing on the walls. Every corner had writing on the walls. Every corner had a corner of trash. Your couch was so black and muddy. Then you had a, a, a pan of potatoes sitting on the table. What's that? Your bedroom was so nasty and trifling with that twin size bed in there. Come on now. Make it make sense, Quenisha, y'all. Jackie and Quenisha, please make it make sense. So make a video on that. When y'all sitting out here making reaction videos about people, Make a video about that, about your trifling ass. How about you do that? Yeah, she still get child support from that man. And you never see Jackie's son because Jackie's son disowned her. That man don't want to be around her. You don't have no pictures with your son standing next to you happy with his arm around you or nothing. The pictures is y'all four distance away from each other. That's what the pictures is. You don't see no pictures with Jackie and her kids on them. Hey, good morning, Tosha. Good morning, Queen. They're nasty. They're trifling. Her kids don't. Her kid don't want to deal with her. She got them two disabled kids at home. She got Quanisha, and then she got him. I guess I didn't know that was her real mama. The way they be acting. Because on um, Phillips' uh, page, he have no no kind of dealings with Jackie. He ain't got nothing about her on her. He ain't got Quanisha on there neither. He ain't got none of that, none of that on there, none of that about them. So I thought they, they was just, you know, acquaintance with each other. But it don't make no sense for a person to come on here and try to dog nobody, try to talk bad about nobody. When they house, you walk in her house, you got to kick stuff out your way to walk through there. That man, he exposed the hell out you. And thank you so much, Bubba, because guess what? They think they better than everybody. Yeah, Jackie, he said you was nasty too. Way I be on her trying to do this. And then Quanisha, you a hoe.
you having sex with anybody you can have sex with. I told you, y'all, that she, when she was kissing that man, she didn't look like she was interested in him. Didn't I tell y'all that? When she kissed him on camera, she was kissing him like, ill. Like, I'm just here for you for the show. Y'all see how she kissed that man? She kissed him like she really was disgusted at him. And I think that my own, as y'all think that one video I made, go back and watch my video that I made. When Kanisha kissed him, Quen Queen K, Quenisha, Quenisha, because her name ain't Queen nothing. When Quenisha kissed that man, she looked like she was disgusted of kissing him. Yep, like daughter, like mama. Her and Jackie is two nasty individuals, two nasty females. And that's sad to say they trifling, they nasty, they ain't got nothing going on with their life. It's ridiculous. It's trifling. It's ridiculous and it's just trifling. It don't make no sense at all. It don't make no sense at all for y'all to be like that. But yeah, okay. But yeah, sit on here and talk about everybody else. Yeah, she was buying him. I told y'all that. I said the only reason why he was Queen K, it's a Queen K on her LOL. But the only reason why he was on her because she was buying him. That's the only reason why she was on her because he was she was buying him. He don't want nothing to do with that girl. That's not his preferences. He was there so he can get the child support took off him, but she took it off and she put it right back on, took it off, put it right back on. That man spent time in jail because of her. That man spent time in jail because of her. So before you come on her and you sit on her trying to criticize people and try to talk down on people, make sure all your eyes are dotted and your T's are crossed. That's what you do. Make sure all your eyes are dotted and your T's are crossed. Because guess what? The stuff you out here pulling, Quenisha, it's not going to slide with nobody. It really ain't. It ain't going to slide with nobody at all. You tried it, baby girl. You tried it real hard. You tried it. So call yourself expose me, girl. You can't expose me because my house is clean, baby. My house clean as a whistle, baby. Yeah, she's trifling. Quenisha's very trifling. And I knew she had to be trifling. You can look at her and tell she's trifling. Every time somebody come on her and has to put on all that makeup and everything to have to disguise behind her, the clown show is ridiculous. Then she looked like a clown come on her with her daughter bows on her with that uh, Dollar General makeup on her face. Yeah, her name says it all. A ghetto-ass name. What type of mama named their daughter that? Ghetto-ass name. You can never get a job. Your, your name tell everything for the future. Hit that like button for you, girl. Yeah, she used to go to Dollar General and get her makeup. Dollar General. And then sometimes she found something at the Goodwill and, and put it on her face. Who wears makeup from the Goodwill? I understand you can buy things from the Goodwill, but makeup, that's against the rules because I know somebody else used that makeup on their face. And it's pathetic. Yes. And, and, and Jackie looking over there looking like a, a bag of bones, a skeleton bones, looking like a bag of skeleton bones. Looking like she about to croak at any minute. Yes. Looking like she about to croak at any minute. You don't take care of your kids, Jackie. You don't do nothing for them kids. You're trifling. You're lazy. You're nasty. You're very nasty. And it's sad. Yes. It do. Because they, they, this is what they do. They sit back. They try to call themselves exposing a person. They went in on when looking at different accounts on my pages. When they found my brother, who I haven't talked to him about four or five years, they went and found him and had him come on her. Like I said, everybody got a past. It's what you do with your future that counts. Everybody got a long past. It's what you do with your future. The time my brother used to be around me, that was the time when I was going through a depression time. When I was sick and I ain't had, you know what I'm saying? Then he even came on her ladder and said I was doing drugs. Said I was doing drugs. I would never in my life do a drug, ever in my life. Only drug I ever did was marijuana. And yeah, I ain't ashamed to say it. I did it. I sure did smoke marijuana before. This man said I was on her taking pills. I was drinking liquor. I was doing all kinds of stuff. First of all, I can't even handle no liquor. Yeah. Who named that child that? But he said I was doing pills. I was doing liquor. I can't control liquor. I drank a, a, a shot of wine or something one day. It couldn't even take it. It's like it make my stomach hurt or something. But then he said I was doing pills. First of all, I'm allergic to pills. I can't even take them because they shut my kidneys down if I even, even try to take a pill. When I got my tooth put, they gave me Tylenol extra strength because I couldn't take the Tylenol with the uh, the Tylenol 3s because it was too strong for me. So I just want to get this one thing clear. Never did a drug ever in my life. Yeah, it talked about me bad. Somebody, he, he had him on there saying I was doing drugs, man. When I sent that, my sister told me that she said, you must really didn't read the video. 
I ain't gonna explain myself, but I'm just saying they should. They try to have you out here looking bad, like you a straight pill popper, a drunkie, an alcoholic, just because you have ten kids. Yeah, I take care of ten kids over her. No, I don't have ten baby daddies. If they would have just came and asked me how many baby daddies would I had, I could have told them. No, I do not have ten baby daddies. No, I don't. Just because it's ten kids, that's that's what they get the mistake and, and get it took in wrong ass. Just because a person take care of ten kids, that don't mean you have ten baby daddies. Then they said my tenth baby daddy. I mean, she what the what video they they made last? My eleven baby daddy broke up with me. Don't y'all see that ring? And that's not my eleventh baby daddy. That's my fiance. I don't have eleven kids over here that I take care of. I only have ten over here that I take care of. Yes, ten. That's it. So with that being said, guys, I just came over here because I had just had to get this out. We're going to go live later on because right now I got to go get the kids together. I got to go pick up my oldest son because he was at his little friend house last night. Yeah, they both are miserable. I got to go pick my son up, do my little mommy duties real quick and get, you know, get things together. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't trying to expose. I mean, I ain't trying to explain nothing to them. I'm just coming to y'all, you know, as my subscribers to let y'all know because that's wrong how they try to portray people and put people out here looking bad like they, you know, some kind of bad person or something. Like they some kind of bad person or something. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. At the end of the day, I still owe it to y'all, you know, to let y'all know. You know, because at the, first, at the end of the day, I'm a woman before anybody. I'm a woman before anything. And if I got to let y'all know some things to get some things clear, I'm going to let you know. I understand, baby. And, you know, I appreciate that. But I'm going to let you know, you know, the little things I have to let you know to let you know. Karma is a mug. Karma is. They did a that call. They said they was riding me like a horse. Thought everything they saying was right. People stopped coming to my channel. People stopped hitting that like button. People stopped uh, leaving comments. I used to have... 1,500 to 2,000 people watching my videos. My whole rating went down. I'm like, oh, they really sitting on her believing this mess, this shit show? This man went three hours on her about a person, and y'all really were, were jacking them. Come on, now, look who they went on her with. And y'all gonna believe it. I can see if they came on her with somebody else, but they came on her with jacking them. Jacking them. Anybody in my family know I do what I got to do. At the end of the day, I do. I'm a mama. I do what I got to do, baby. And I do it. Do you hear me? We're going to get this video to about 800 likes. About 2 or 3,000 uh, 3, um, viewers. And we need y'all to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button for your girl. Because guess what? We're going to make videos from here on out, baby. Y'all came for me. I'm going to come for y'all harder. And I want y'all to go check out my workout video. Because I put a workout video. Because um, since I've been breastfeeding, my appetite has increased. Yeah, they both deleted their account. I ain't never deleted my account no matter what. I never deleted my account because I know it was the truth and was not the truth. If it was the truth, I would delete my account. But guess what? I stayed strong and I stayed on her because I'm doing better than anybody ever can do right now. Well, not anybody in the world, but, you know, anybody around who me who's talking stuff about me, I'm doing way better than them. I'm doing way better than them. I don't do no drugs. I don't smoke. You know what I'm saying? I do no drugs. I'm glad I never was the type of person to do drugs. I'm glad I was never the type of person to like to drink. You can have a, a drink every now and then. I ain't saying nothing's wrong with drinking. You can have a drink every now and then. You know, that's up to you. But just don't abuse it when you got kids at her. Take care of family first. Yeah, I know. Jackie was jealous, baby. They jealous of every black woman out here just trying to do something for themselves. But now the shoe is on the other feet. I want to see how they're going to wear it. They just made a video 10 hours ago of Chrissy. Why y'all study picking on Chrissy? Chrissy doing her thing right now. Shout out to you, strong mama Chrissy. Chrissy doing her thing right now. I love Chrissy and her kids. Every time she make a video, I go and watch it. I'm glad she doing good. Yeah, I know. I let them all talk. You see, I just sat back. They thought they was just going to, re, you know, have my YouTube channel all messed up. Don't nobody, oh, ain't nobody going to view her. Ain't nobody going to watch her no more. You know, but I stay strong. I'm still making videos. All that stuff. And later on today, I'm coming back with another video about them.
Part two, Quinesha getting exposed. <laughs> Come on now. Yeah, I like it. I love it. So with that being said, Quinesha gonna clean up your house. Jackie gonna let them disabled twins out the closet. Let them out the closet so they can breathe. Go get your kids medicine adjusted. Quit sitting on lab all day. Quit drinking all day. Yeah, I took off your YouTube channels. Ah, that's sad. You're running. You're running. See that? Smooches. See them kiss signs on my shirt? Yeah, we do need to lift each other up. But every time you try to lift a person up, them two evil witches over there bring people down. They bring people down. That's what my, that's what my video is about. My videos be about uplifting people. Not turn people down. But when you try to uplift somebody, you had them witches coming on her, like Jackie and Qu Quinesha, coming on her, trying to turn a person down because she's trying to look out for her sisters. But she, when you're trying to look out for sisters, they get mad at me because I defend women. I defend all kind of women. I don't care what color you is and none of that. I'm defending you if somebody saying something wrong about you. But they ain't like that. They try to shut me down. Baby, they tried to shut me down. Quinesha was so happy a month ago. Oh, my gosh. Did you guys hear that? Exposing Lena. That's not my name. Lena's not my name. It's Lene. Yeah, they want to be white so bad, but they can't. Your white baby daddy exposed you. <laughs> Once you go black, they say you don't go back. I bet you went back. His family don't even like her. His family wasn't even at the wedding. It was just Jackie and some man. And they ain't even no wedding. That was just a fake pretend wedding. They wouldn't even, they wouldn't even have to participate. They weren't finna participate in that shit show. They was not finna participate in that shit show. Yeah, they, they, they love to turn black queens down. And Jackie never had pictures of her kids up, but she always got Quinesha mixed kids in her videos. She never had pictures of her kids at all, period, point blank. Never. I've never seen her kids in there. But you always got Quinesha kids in there. Sure do. Let me put on this hoodie. It's cool. You always got Quinesha kids in there. For real. You really do. You always got her kids in there. But you never have your kids in your videos. Never. Oh, it's up there. You have to go go uh go to type in Queen Queen's K. And it's gonna pop up on her. Just type in Queen's K and it's gonna pop up on her. You'll see the video. Baby, he set her out. He said the kids broke three TVs. They broke a PlayStation. They broke her laptop. He said them kids run around like wild dogs every day. And you try to talk about my kids. She get mad. She used to be like, we don't hear kids in the background. That's because my kids have respect. No, you're not going to hear my kids running in the background, playing, jumping up and down, writing on walls. No. Because they have respect for their mother. Yeah. My kids had respect. She used to always be like, why we don't hear no kids? Why the kids are gone? She never had her kids. She never had a baby. I have my baby, but my baby is not spoiled. My baby is not even spoiled. My baby will sit there and watch me all day. She'll sit there, she'll play. My baby is a breastfed baby. She's not a spoiled baby. I don't hold my baby all day. So when I sit it down, she's going to go, wah, wah. No, I don't do that. You have to train kids at an early age. That's what you have to do. And that's what I do. My kids are respectful. If I'm doing a laugh, they're not going to come screaming. Mama this, mama that. Say what you got to say before I get laughed. Get what you want to get. Get what you need to get before I go laugh. Because my kids have respect. And my kids have relatives that they go to houses. So if I'm at home by myself and it's just me and my baby and she's sitting there quiet and you don't hear no background, I'm getting a break. I'm getting a break. So with that being said, stop being jealous so much. Quit hating on me. I'm doing me. Thirsty, I go take my business classes. I love you too, boo. Thirsty, I go take my business classes. I'm so happy. I just don't understand. I'm so happy. I'm going to be my own boss. That's all I've been waiting on. I'm going to school to take a...